Even now, I can't recall if she came to me in a dream. Or if awake, my path happened upon hers. Hazy impressions. Unable to settle on any detail. Like peering through window panes at pastries on display. So intoxicated I was by her brightness and glitter. Ornaments dangling, jangling from every surface. A cacophony of colors. The unsettling green of her dress. Layers of petticoats. Marigold, violet, and blue. Her figure curving in and out. Roundness where I had none. Breakable curves. Glassy pupils, hollow under eyes rimmed with rouge paper, framed above by lashes blackened with cork, painted lips. I closed my eyes and inhaled the scent of her. Chalk powder, fresh hides, vinegar solution, and boot black, aroma of industry entangled in her musk. A delicious smell of possibilities and pleasure. Shiny coins jingling in silk purses. I breathed again. More deeply this time. So I could savor the lingering trail of her odor. Her fragrance seeped through my pores. Expanding within my limbs. Till my insides were filled. I nestled in her crinolines, rolled in her silks, lay amongst her ostrich feathers, entombed, cocooned. But now my senses slip away, moving beyond where I can grasp, powerless to halt. I rise to the surface of this murky haze, my eyelids flutter. I will them to stay dark, but they do not obey. In a moment, light fills my vision, and she is gone.